Hello everybody, my name is Jared and welcome to Jar Red Gaming. Welcome to a game called Backrooms. We did a reaction video on the Backrooms, understandably quite creepy and strange. And we played a Backrooms game forever ago. This one is probably more like the recent video considering the popularity of that video. It also looks much better than the one we played back in the day just as far as like it's unreal engine and stuff like that so everything's going to be shiny and glossy and stuff i'm really interested to see where this one goes so that without further ado let's dive straight in first day of a new job oh huge company i don't even know what they do exactly i was supposed to go to the archives to sort out some documents whoa and here we are in the archives Oh my gosh, documents, here I come. Fire alarm, quick. Nice, just stock corporate photo. What a weird place for that. Okay, what do we have here? Liminal spaces, disappears, abductions, and glitches. Put this docks in cabinets. Great, 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 great. What about these on top? Not my concern. Papers on the floor, not my concern. Okay. All right, well, let's go ahead and get started. Let's start in alphabetical order. Abductions, A. Here we go. This goes here, yes. That's not what file cabinets usually look like on the inside, but you know what? We'll just roll with it. We'll just roll with it. It's fine. And on to disappears with a big old D. Hopefully we don't get the D by the back rooms, if you know what I mean. And we've got glitches, good old glitches. I don't know why we have an entire folder dedicated to glitches, but there you go. Is there anything hidden back here? You all know how I am about secrets. I like to find the secrets, and if I can't find them, they don't exist. That's definitely probably not true. Um, liminal spaces, good old L, good old L. Gonna take the L on this one, I'm sure of it. Here, oh God, oh my God. Ooh. We no clipped, we just no clipped, just like the video. <laughs> oh. Oh my, we're, we're just another victim of this unstable program called life. This, this underdeveloped software called our world that we live in is a simulation and we just keep, people just keep no clipping through the damn floor. Wait, better pick up all these papers before I go, right? Why? Why do I need to pick these up? It's even counting them. I have 20 pages. Why do I need them? Where do I begin? Let's just start walking. Hello? Hello? Anyone here? Ooh, yeah, this... I mean, this is straight out of the video. But I mean, the back rooms has always just been a maze of yellow... walls. <laughs> this one's... Oh! I can lay down pages as like a breadcrumb trail. Interesting. Well, there's something down there. I thought I was trying to zoom in on it, but apparently right click does not do that. Follow voices. I don't want to. I think that's a bad idea. I mean, I definitely hear some voices slightly. We'll leave a piece of paper here. I guess. You know what? No, because why would I need to come back here? We need to find an exit. Whoa. Help, I'm lost. Are these messages from other people who have no clipped into this reality? I think following the voices is a really bad idea. I think it's a very, very bad idea. But you know what? This is what we do here. We do bad ideas. Ooh. What is it? What is it even? Exit. Is this an exit? I'm leaving a piece of paper here. Is this an exit? Can I actually... Whoa! Oh my god. That's super cool. I hear footprints. I hear footsteps. I hear footsteps. Okay, so we need to find a code. Looks like a four... Probably a four number code on a desk. Oh my gosh, I hear something. Now, there's some items we need to find and there's codes attached to them, it sounds like. I hear footsteps. I don't even want to go out there. Oh, I can open the door, but it leads nowhere. Ooh, Ooh there's stuff down there. 
I hate that our footsteps are so loud. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, is that from the file room? Or is this one of the objects we need to find with a code on it? Five. Alright, well, we got one part of the code. Just three more to go. Ooh, this is that... This is... This is straight out of that spot from the video. Almost. Just a narrow opening to look through. Saw the door, but lost. Oh. This is very strange. Is that a seven in the chair? That's a seven. Very strange. Just light just hanging in this chair. No clipping. And we got this weird shadow door. What in the world? That's freaking weird. Ooh. Ooh. Another item. Is that a four? That looks like a four to me. I mean, honestly, we could probably guess the code. We have three numbers, and we could probably guess the final code if we really, really want to. Ooh, I don't like this. I don't like a long hallway. I got a bad feeling about this. Ooh, that's the desk. Okay, we won't need to guess. We won't need to guess, presumably. Is that a nine or a six? Okay, that's definitely... It's either a nine or a six. I'm gonna say it's a six, but it could also be a nine. Okay, I think we've got... We need to get through that door code. Watch out for it. Oh, no. Okay, so now we just need to find our... We need to find our way back. I've been leaving pages along the way. Yes, 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 here we go. See, I've been leaving pages on purpose. Ooh. What in the world? Oh, we have to go down. We have to. Oh, jeez! I don't know what happens. I guess we just freaking died, right? We just died. I hear footsteps. I hear footsteps. I hear footsteps. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, it's a ghostly gas man, it's a freaking, ooh, that's it, that's the one, that's the it, that's the one that says beware of it. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, well, alright, not as creepy as the, um, the video, unless there's more than one monster. Okay, follow the voices, follow the voices, and we're back. Okay, the code could be 6574. I don't think that worked, so maybe... Maybe 9574. <gasps> that worked! Oh! Oh! We escaped! Oh, we made it! Alright, well there you have it, that is Back Rooms, the game, very similar to the video, the creature was not nearly as creepy as the one in the video, but the entire atmosphere of the game was pretty tense, as it should be, because you never know what's waiting around that corner, you never know what's waiting at the end of that dark hallway. Um, this looked great, it played great, I wish the monster was a little scarier, but other than that, I really enjoyed this, and I hope you guys did too. If you did, please leave a like, and of course, please subscribe, and let me know what you guys thought of this game in the comments down below, let me hear your theories of the back rooms, it is fascinating, and I want to know and hear more. And as always, thank you so very much for watching, you've been awesome, let's play again soon, and I'll see you in the next video.